To have a major in lands, you need to make sure that you do a certain number of credits in your major subject each year. Often you do declare your intended major in first year, but lots of people don't stick with this. As long as you have enough credits over your four years of study, you can choose your major at the end of the degree, so you can change what you want your major to be fairly easily, you don't have to declare it each time you change, and you can try out lots of different disciplines and modules. It is also worth thinking about whether you want to graduate with a BA, BSc, um, liberal arts and sciences um, degree title or natural sciences degree title um, because these also depend on the type and amount of modules that you do such as more or less science modules. So now when you have a from research policy module which is a two hour long seminar with pre-recorded lectures to watch beforehand and then in the following years, it's called interdisciplinarity and both modules are lens only. So as I've just said, there is the From Research Policy module and the interdisciplinarity module. So I'm just going to briefly explain how From Research Policy works. So in the first semester, you will be put into a group of about five lens students who each major in something different. For example, in my group, we're majoring in geography, history, psychology, economics, and creative writing. So each member of the group brings their own set of knowledge into the mix, and you can put to practice what you're learning in your own different modules. So at the beginning, you will have to find a social issue to tackle in the Birmingham area. And by the end of the first semester, you will have a solution to that social issue. And you will need to sustain that solution with a report with statistics, articles and facts to show why it would work. And then semester two, you will campaign for that social issue. During the whole semester, you will find, you will use social media, website, visuals, anything you want. You can help a charity, do donations. It really helps you to find how to campaign. So if you want to see the kind of campaigns we are running right now as first years, you can head over to our Instagram at lens underscore uniband and look at our highlights from Research Policy 2, which just shows a bit of the campaigns we've publicized from the groups who asked us. So if you decide to study music modules at the University of Birmingham, you have access to the beautiful Bramble Building, where the department is based. And this has the lovely dome practice room, the Algar concert hall, and additional practice rooms and instrument storage, which are only available if you do take music modules. You also can use the Franklin practice blocks, which are available to you if you are a performance student and if you're part of the music society. Also, as part of the music society, you can join any one of the many ensembles here at the University of Birmingham from orchestras, big bands, jazz, flute choirs, samba, you've got the lot. Also within the society, you can get involved in helping manage the ensembles, helping run the, the society as a whole, or even things like conducting. So there's a lot of opportunities here at the University of Birmingham. First year of university is a bit of a change from A-levels or other qualifications like IB and your experiences will largely depend on the subjects and the modules that you take. A lot of first year for me was working out how I learnt best, how to manage my time and working on skills like referencing that I hadn't really done in secondary school. In first year I majored in philosophy and also took anthropology, international relations and economics. I found that once I'd understood the level of the work that was expected and um, the kind of quantity of work I had to do each week, I did find um, first year a little less stressful than A-levels. This was mostly because I was able to manage my time very differently, I wasn't constrained by like normal school hours, so I could work at times where I was feeling most productive, and I found that this um, made it easier for me to enjoy my work. I do know some people who did find it harder, however, in first year compared to A-levels, so it will really depend on your experiences. Everybody at uni is really supportive though, so regardless of whether you're finding it difficult or not, there should be um, enough support on hand to help you. Especially in a degree like LANS, where everybody is doing different modules, different disciplines, different majors, um, everybody does have different experiences, but I do know that first year is very exciting. Um, and a, a really great challenge.